Hi. Um, we're back. We're back. We're doing uh, Dark Pictures Anthology. <laughs> we're doing Little Hope, uh, which is the second game in the series, because why start in order? Don't no, it was well. just, it was well. <laughs> more convenient, because what is it? You own the first and the second game. Yeah. So I figured while we're on your account. Might as well do. Might as well do the second game, the one I don't have. Yeah. Yeah. I was commenting on the fact that uh, Jason needs a TV above me because I'm like laying down and the microphone is just hanging over my face. <laughs> I mean, we could probably realistically do that. Just right there, dude. Just, yeah. Just right, just right above my head. Like, well, and if I it thought falls about, on me and kills me, then that's how I go. <laughs> uh, for reference, we're doing, we're recording in my computer room and I just set up like two little small recliners and then in front of like a spare 32 inch tv that i had Mm -hmm. um like non-smart tv and so it's like it's not the right resolution it's not the right size for what we're trying to use it for um but if i were to hover it over tim's chair like six inches from his noodle (laughs) um, it's the appropriate size (laughs) it's fine i'm laying down officially because i have food in my belly yeah, he's and it's, I'm processing it, turning it into he's, power. He's been fed, so we we got like a good forty minutes before he's asleep. You have like ten minutes before I'm asleep, and then like forty minutes after that of me being sleepy, and then awake at midnight. <laughs> Not based on your audio levels, you're fading fast. Uh, that's what I was worried about, actually. Really? Yeah, because of the way that the microphone is ang- angled. Oh, actually, you're you're fine. I was right. just I was good giving you a tease. Oh. But I was worried that like I mean, you can't get that puppy any closer. Like I might hear whiskers scratching against it if you move it any closer. Uh so you're correct. It looks like uh don't play alone. Play with your friends. I don't know if it's a uh... um oh uh movie night. No, go to the bottom. This one? Okay, that one's online with a friend. Movie night is, yeah, that's two yeah. to five friends together in a room. Yep. I don't know three other people, so... Shh. <laughs> <laughs> sh- I can't wait to be just chaotic in this. I'm just a complete, like, fucking maniac. Oh, God. New story. Here we go. After he adjusts his microphone. Fine, I'll sit up. YouTube person. <laughs> <laughs> if it helps, I'll kick you out of the house early because I gotta work tomorrow. Oh, yeah. And then my lazy ass, and I'm not getting up. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah. But you will be up. Oh, I'll be you, up. You'll text me at six and be like, why am I up? And I'll be like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to work. I'll be like, fine, I'll go to the gym. <laughs> No, I'll text you at 10 and be like, sorry, I got this four hours late. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get this going. Uh... Um, play it. Oh, uh, names, right? I think so. New slot. Uh... Do, you want me, do you want me to go type in names? I... Or... Is that, like, are we typing? You got it? I got it. Okay. We're going to see if this is actually typing. Yeah. Yep. Nope. <laughs> God <laughs> damn it. <laughs> He's like, you don't get to play. <laughs> I'm trying so hard. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Jeeves, we've changed our minds. <laughs> Jeeves, go back to the monitor projector please it's like you didn't say please before that's why i left (laughs) (laughs) necromank roman (laughs) (laughs) roe minnesota sir Unless you wanted something more clever. Nope. There you go. 
Isn't Pete Davidson in this? Or is it the other one? I think that's the other one. Who's this guy? I want this guy to get fucking stabbed, though. Him, too. Looks like John Oliver. Kind of. It does, like, um, it? like if he went on like a, like a licorice bender or something. Licorice? Yeah, just like all the licorice. Sure. Sorry, I tried to think of like a shitty like sugar snack. There. I just auto-assigned us. Did you? Yep. Okay, doesn't matter. Otherwise, I'm going to spend like the next hour and a half trying to decide the perfect character and what shirt they're wearing. <laughs> to play with the controller, press A. To play with the mouse and keyboard, press the mouse. Uh, don't tell me how to live my life, game. <laughs> I'm going to do whatever I want. This is like the worst time to realize I have to go to the bathroom. I'll hold it. <laughs> well, uh, pause everything. I got to take a shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back in 45 to 58 minutes. <laughs> a diner's a terrorist. Blow it up. <laughs> diner's a terrorist. Blow it up. I'm going to go take a shit. <laughs> yep. This is going to be good because I don't know who we are yet. Right. That's what I should have been. I should have been a bus driver. All those children on fire. <laughs> also frozen to death somehow. <laughs> burning. Cold burning. <laughs> Isn't that just hydrogen? Cold burning? Yeah. The fuck are you talking about? No, like it's so cold it burns. It's hydrogen, isn't it? Uh, are you thinking of liquid nitrogen? Yes. Get on hand, it burn. <laughs> oh, liquid nitrogen would do that. Also acid. No, that's all burn. Burn cause cold. <laughs> yeah, I want burn cause cold, not burn cause burn. <laughs> Dude, are your brights on? <laughs> He's a bus driver, of course his brights are on. He seems to be outpacing his lights, but... Oh, maybe that's just me. Do the buses move? Are you saying the bus is moving faster than light? No, like... Like, he's moving too fast where he's going to be able to react in a sensible time. Oh, well, never no. mind. He looks familiar, too. Like an actor, you know. They actually used, like, real actors for this. It, it looks like it. Not like, the, like... Like, the detail's really good. Yeah, and I mean, like, movie or TV show style actors, not just, like, people that are doing the, the background motion capture. Yeah. We got a problem. Should probably put subtitles on. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You're not my dad. You I'll drive this bus right over that fucking bridge. Confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Head up the East Road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. Did, did he say he has people on the bus? Yeah. He's just trying to get the people where they need to be. Okay. So, but he stopped at a diner. Uh, I think he stopped at a diner just to, like, everybody let them off and feed them. Like, even greyhounds do that. Okay. He's gonna fall asleep. Everybody's gonna die. He's really nervous. He looks very clammy. Yeah, he definitely, like, there's something wrong. Oh, good. Uh, like, I'm, I'm over here, like, turning it up and, like, trying to hear. Yeah. Um, subtitles on. Hey, it's fine. Just a quick deep The world's deep smallest deep. subtitles. It's all okay. Oh, please, John, could you not patronize me? Could you keep it down, please? Yeah, shut the fuck up. I'm trying to run over children. <laughs> At a certain point, when are people just going to learn just fucking send it right through that person? 
like nine times out of ten. Uh, I think you have to at least apply the brake. Otherwise, you're going to be prosecuted. Yeah, apply the brake, but keep it straight. Like, I don't know. <sighs> okay. I don't know. Maybe I've just seen too many horror movies where it's like, and not like uh, ten times out of ten, it's it's just a ghost. It's an apparition. Yeah, yeah. just run it the fuck over. You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Yeah, I flipped the buzz. At each other again. I can. You're drunk. What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's not it. Never is. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory... You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after ten beers. Reverend not Carl wrong. held her back after prayers today. That's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For nothing? Single-handedly keeping our family together family. is far from nothing in my book. I could use a little help. Maybe if we'd had kids of our own, none of this would be happening. That's a real low blow. Don't you get how tough You're this is You're not the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. Not right now. Somebody that's had 10 beers, he's really just holding it together. No slurring, like he's walking fine. <laughs> I, I think 10 beers might have been an exaggeration. Like, for all we know, he's a lightweight and had two. True. Tanya's late. She always is these days. Uh Oh, it's me. Okay. Tanya has always been late. Nah, not really. Only since she's been seeing him. That guy's no good for her. All that new age bullshit. Reminds me of some creepy cult. Cult. He came in last week. We shot the breeze a little bit. I like him. That one's a classic. Legendary vinyl. Quit pawing at it, will you? <clears throat> I'm rude. Right. She looks like her brain is fried. Mind the goddamn vinyl, will you? Come on, man. Take some time off from being a dick and give her a break. Okay, Mother Superior. Why are you always sticking up for her anyway? What what is this? What is this a hostel or something? I don't know. I think so. They're Oh, they must be like foster, foster parents. parents. Yeah. I'm going to start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. How's things? Let me guess. He's been pumping iron again. They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? Dad's been drinking. Who could have guessed it? They're always fighting these days, getting predictable, like a record that keeps playing over and over. Dennis, for the 10 millionth time, will you ship that shit of yours up into the attic? Hey, some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought-after collection. <laughs> Just yelling to yell now at this point? Pretty much, yeah. It seems like everybody just wants to be a dick to be a dick. It's curled up his ass. He's being even more annoying than usual tonight. A real jerk. So what else is I wonder why the compass is like naturally flowing in one direction. Yeah, uh, I think that? it's yeah, it might pick for you. If you don't do something it picks for you. Yeah. 
it might uh it might uh, be tied to like how fast you pick too. Not now, sis. Sure. I'm busy. Aw, oh, poor kid. Oh no. He's gonna fall. <gasps> hey! Quit acting crazy! You's gonna die. She gonna die too. Yeah, haunted ass child. Jesus. You scared me, sweetheart. I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I'd like to have a bath in peace. Take a break from this madhouse for a while. Can somebody please pay attention to this child? Yeah. Because she's about to Michael Myers this whole fucking house. I hope so. I mean, I do too, but... not a great idea for me to get involved. You know what I'm like? I just upset someone. They sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. I don't get why everyone keeps picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shiny. Uh, because she's like running around as Samara. <laughs> Concerned. better to leave Megan alone. As her big sister, it is my sworn legal duty to check in on her. Right, sure. Like you're the law around here. She went upstairs. I'll go find her. This is a very interesting way that it's playing. Yep. I'm liking it so far. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> na, na, na. When did it say this was? 80s? Oops. You need to keep an eye on your little sister. Mom is real worried about her. It's okay, Dad. Tanya's checking on her right now. You want to try raising a family like this? Not particularly. Would struggle with you guys. We're fine if you guys didn't suck so hard. Okay. So I'm just gonna wander this fucking way. Hey, Tanya, you up there? How's Megan doing? Don't know, haven't seen her yet. Keep it down, will ya? Trying to sleep here. Now you've done it. Sleeping Beauty waits. Forget him, find Megan. Relax, I'm on it. Do me a favor. Quit yelling for a couple of minutes. House could use some quiet. Yeah, fuck you, dude. Yeah, because you're all about keeping the place quiet. Listen, funny guy. I've had a rough day. It's all the noise about, anyway. Just checking in with Tanya and Megan. Good luck with that. Megan's a handful. I like how he's just like, I hear some person quiet. Yet yeah, the TV is drowning out the house. Yep. Yeah. Super fucking loud. I like how you go, you keep going in there for like two set. Like two sentences. Yet standing right at his feet. Yeah. Like if you want to check on your sister, just fucking go up there. Is there like Oh yeah, and I started this like fucking twenty minutes ago and <laughs> Nothing yet. Yeah. Attendance, okay. Oh, I guess I have to hold it, right? 
Neat. Whatever. Wait, wait, can I see that again? Sure. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Days absent. So 18? Wait, oh, 18 total. Yeah. So it looks like total for the year she's been gone for 26 days. Well, like tardies. Or late, late and absent. At present for 173 days. Okay. Yeah. Oh. You could be right about my family. I think so too. Tanya. There it is. Ghost hand. Locked me out. It's fucking freezing. Yep, Michael Myers' this whole fucking house. I'll let you back in. Go easy on Megan. Hold on. What's that the floor, floor made, made of? of? Yeah. Shit. Megan. Oh, fuck say kick the door in. Your house is Seriously, as soon as you saw the fire, it should you should have broken the window. Yep. The kitchen's on fire. Are you fucking serious? Megan. Seriously, what what is your house made of? Gasoline? <laughs> Jump down, dude. Where the hell is everybody? Anthony, help! Jump. It's snow. You'll be fine. So do I have to make a decision on who to live, who to save? Because I don't like any of these fucking people. <laughs> Just the dude with the records. Hey. Yep. Try breathing through your nose. Did that not work? Okay. <laughs> I forget what the statistic is, but it's like I don't know, it's probably something like two thirds of people die within like ten feet of the door. Look at all those gold teeth. I wonder if it's because I made poor decisions that all of this is happening, you think? Nah. I think this fire happens regardless. Um, Are you seriously going to help Megan? Like, is seriously a thought? No, I'm not actually. Jump! Jump for the ninth time. You just leap. Uh, probably the drain pipe? The drain pipe and climb down. Look at her face. Uh, no. <laughs> wow, she dies anyway. Flip. Yep. Oh! 
But Tim, why don't you wear scarves? This dude is going to be f fucked up forever. I pick like the worst options for this this man. Oh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude. What the fuck? Yep. What have you done? Mom, stop! I think I was correct. I think I picked wrong, and that was the bad ending. No! Part of me thinks so. No way! You didn't make any real decisions. Like, this family dies anyway. I'm calling it. Well, yeah, but the the kid that I was, he was um, an option to pick in the beginning, remember? It was somebody that I could be. Sure. That's fine. It just means there'd be a different cold open of somebody else whose entire family dies because they lit a match. That looks like the guy from uh, Terminator 2. Oh yeah. Yeah, the uh the T1000? Yeah. Or T2000? T1000. Yeah, that was it. The liquid metal one. Yep. Yeah. Who is that? Well, in the uh the other games in this series, I've seen the one that has um, Robert uh, Robert Patrick. The other one has Pete Davidson in it. And Are that, you thinking of the Quarry? Maybe, because that's also like a movie one. Um, it's a part of the same series though, but it's like you can make the smallest decision, and it could affect like the entire rest of the game based on that one little like. I decide to drink a soda instead of I don't decide to drink a soda and like you get the bad ending because of it. Yeah. Like that's why yeah. I'm not that's why I'm, for this that's why I was saying like I wouldn't be surprised if it was just like oh no you picked all the wrong shit and everybody died. No, Do I know again. Pete <laughs> I know Pete Davidson isn't it's, it's not these because like it's the same cast of actors for the first four games until dawn. That's the one I was thinking of. Until dawn? Yeah. Oh, okay. He's gonna be like, this is a collection of murder. I don't believe that we've met before, have we? Uh, no. Welcome to my repository. I am the curator, the guardian of all these wonderful stories. And I have a very special tale for you to tell. What was this game's budget? Like, like Jesus. The graphics on this are amazing. It's a DirectX 12, man. It's great looking. Disconcerting, no? I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. You would not believe how little this I care. This particular story isn't fully fleshed out. It's only part written, and the choices you make will complete it. Fire. No, there was nothing you could have done about that. What's happened has happened. Or has it? Anyway, look to the future, I say. Life's but a walking shadow, eh? You are about to enter... A the Twilight Zone. Perhaps disturbing world. How disturbing might depend on what you choose to believe and how confusing on the path you choose to take. There are an infinite number of directions in which one could travel. 
We seldom have all the information that we'd like, but we have to choose our path nonetheless. Sure. So that we mm -hmm. get the clarity and the outcomes that we want. As in life, your decisions will matter. Bro, I just came here for a bowl of cereal. Like, this is way too much for this early in the morning. <laughs> okay, it's nighttime. <laughs> well, I meant in the game. I'm assuming it's morning. How many more deaths is entirely up to you? I want everybody dead. I mean, you wouldn't have to make very serious decisions if everybody around you is dead. <laughs> right? It's like, which hole do I put this one in? It's fine. It goes in the square hole. <laughs> Yeah, the square hole. My advice for what it's worth is to thine own self be true. You don't want that. It's going to be the worst story of your life. It's going to be over in like 10 minutes. <laughs> I'm here simply to record what you do, not to help you. I'm not supposed to interfere, you see. Not my place. Apparently. But I am apparently allowed to share wise words from great storytellers that have gone before where I feel that that would be appropriate. Oh, one final thing before I let you Oh, go. great. Yeah. There are pictures in Little Hope that will, if found, show you a vision of a possible future, something that may or may not happen. Use them. They might help you. Or they might not help you. You have a funeral to attend. Off you go. Have fun. Hmm. Okay, so uh, the house burning down with everybody and yourself included in it. Tutorial. Yeah. Gotcha. I love how he basically just addressed us and went, yeah, you couldn't have avoided that. Let's yeah. move on. Yeah. I'm just like, Ugh, fuck you. <laughs> I had theories, man. None of us here today can understand why this tragic accident happened. I can. But we can take comfort from You tried to make coffee on the stove. No. Uh, somebody put a doll in the stove. No, it never would have happened if you didn't try to make coffee on the stove. It was nighttime. Probably making tea, actually. Dude, that guy looks like he had a whole bird in his mouth. Brah. Yeah, he's just like trying to hide the fact that he's got a bird in his mouth. Brah. Wouldn't you? Don't want to make a scene. Yeah, right. Especially at a funeral. Man. Oh. Cool. I'm alive. Anxious and detached. What? This was apparently after the fire. Nope. Where the hell's Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. Oh yeah, the bus crash. Ah! Yep. Instead of goofing around, you wanna lend a hand here? How is he doing anyway? Doesn't look that serious. Could be concussed. Okay, Professor. Or should I call you doctor now? Why don't you try calling for help? <coughs> Maybe the cops, someone like that. I already tried once, but I'm on it. Oh, you get traits and shit? Hey, Andrew, buddy, how you doing? Where are we? What happened? Yeah, the bus crashed. We're okay, though, just shaking up. If you say so. I don't remember being in any crash. You're, you're probably in shock. Maybe a mild concussion in there, too. Give yourself some time. Stay here. Don't move. <clears throat> Fucking thing, useless piece of crap! 
we'll be dead. Okay, take it easy. We'll figure out what to do. Oh, I'm not gonna like you. Oh. Oh. Convenient. Yeah. Hey, anyone up there? Hey, Daniel, that you? John, good to hear you. Daniel? Taylor, you okay? I'm good. We're fine too, thanks for asking. You okay down there? I'm all right. Nothing I can't deal with. Hey, John. It looks like the dad and the mom. Not sure. <laughs> and that it looks like the, the sister to avoid and the record the guy. Is he down there, by the way? Nope. No sign of him. Weird. He isn't up here either. Can you get back up to us? Looks pretty steep. I see a trail down here I could try. Great. Take the trail. Should take you to the road. We can regroup there. That's a plan. See you soon. <coughs> hey, Taylor. Help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? Wait. I don't remember anything. R who are you? It's okay. You're concussed. I'm John, your college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. <laughs> uh, we'll find the others, get some help. Think of it as a character building exercise. <sighs> Teamwork at its finest. It, um, stream was so real. Did you did you notice that the moon and the sun were out? No, it was a street light. Is a street light? Yeah. Okay. But in case it comes up, the moon is full. The others are on. We'll come out down the road. We'll meet them there. Why can't we stay here? No. We could be here all night. Our best move is to get to the others, then head towards town. See if we can find some help. Where's the driver? Shouldn't he be back by now? The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. Okay. <laughs> How you, like, moved night. your head. A little bit, like you were gonna say something, and then you just hey, like went, "Ah, eh, fuck it." <laughs> he is a professor, right? I'm still fuzzy. Can we stick together? I don't want to wait on my own. I guess he's right. We should all stick together. I got no signal either. Must be some kind of black spot. Or you didn't pay your last bill. Did you get that during the crash? <laughs> guess so. Just throw it out on a limb. I'm adorable. <laughs> I think you should show him a little more respect. He thinks he's smarter than us, but book smart is no good out here. He's all up himself acting like the big man on campus. True. Hey, concussed boy, where Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I lost him. Kind of an interesting way they're doing two player. Yeah. Abandon hope. Oh, got it. Unreadable? Really? That's unreadable? Hmm. Doesn't look unreadable to me. Yeah. You know this place? Little Hope? No. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know Little Hope. Why should I have heard of this place? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. I could be careless. How do you know all this stuff anyway? <laughs> I'm a professional academic. I read books, unlike some. Eat decks. <laughs> Easy, Einstein. I can match everything you got with just a smartphone. Well, your phone isn't so smart without a signal. Got you there. 
traits updated. Curious has gone up. Anybody check the bus for supplies? Or yeah, or I would have. Like, I would have liked to check the bus, but good yeah. to see you too. Finally, everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own sweet time. I was getting worried. No, we weren't. I bet you were. This gate is chained. We can't get through. Look around. See if there's anything we can use to break it. I hate this professor. Yep. Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one, push. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Great job, you two. The only two people I like so far are our characters that they randomly said. assign to us. <laughs> Not head into town like John wants. And we've already concluded this conversation. Not with everyone here, we didn't. We should vote on it. No need for a vote. Decisions made. You scared you'll lose? There's not gonna be a vote. I'm sorry, but we really don't have time to be arguing. You'll stay here with me, won't you? Uh. Looks like he ain't so keen after all. You got something to say to me, spit it out. John's right. Heading into town is our quickest way to find help. Satisfied? Sure. Whatever you say. Try to be civil. Costs nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did you say about me? You always get your boyfriend to stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. kidding he is not my boyfriend what have you been telling her i didn't say a thing keep out of our business okay we are wasting valuable time here can we please just keep moving i'm still not sure heading into town is such a great idea i'm going to hang out by the bus while you all do whatever you have to you want to come along and wait with me i'm with the professor on this one our best play is heading into town and getting some help Makes no difference what any of us says. You always do whatever you want. Come on, Taylor, don't check out on us. It's a bad idea to be out here walking around alone. Come with us. Don't worry about me. I'll flag down the first car I see and come get you all real soon. Come with us. Are you kidding me? I'm not going anywhere with you. Yeah, I'm with you. Like, I wouldn't go anywhere with those fucking pricks. The one lady being an asshole to me, Daniel being a I dick. Huh. So you thought better of going it alone then? Why'd you come back? I don't get it. This just doesn't make any sense. Lost in a world of her own. What the hell are you playing at? You going or not? Hey, wait. What are you doing? Taylor. Look out! What the? What's going on with you? Why do you keep coming back? I'm not coming back! I walk straight out every time! It's like... I don't know, I can't fucking leave or something! Okay, let's try something. We'll all go together. We came from that direction. We must be able to go back that way. I want everyone to stay real close. No stragglers. God, I hate you. On a kid's line? Okay, okay, I'm coming. I hope, kind of hope she dies first. <laughs> I admit that is a little odd. Oh, do you? It's not possible. It's just like I've been saying, we are trapped. We can't leave here. Now okay. what do we do? Okay. Calm down. Breathe. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. No. I mean, we all died in the crash. Yeah, nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. I know who I'd like to be kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. 
Now we're stuck here in Little No Hope. That is way out of line. Is it? I had no way of knowing that damn bus would crash. You can't put that on me. Are you for fucking real? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest of us. I'm sorry. I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like you said, we're trapped in a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. We'll figure a way out of this together. Someone else thinks they can do a better job? Step right up. Maybe it isn't real. We have to get out of here. Why is everybody's right? voice getting all weird? Football coaching. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Now let's be logical. The fog is between us and the bus. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. There is nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There is nowhere else we can go except into that damn town. Yeah, if you can't go backwards, go forward. You're leaving me? Where are you going? Come on, let's go with them. Until we know what's up, we should stick together. I'm really, really against going into town. Where'd you get that fruit? No biggie. Must have got it when the bus crashed. I mean, I'm with you on that, but you definitely can't go back. Stay close to Daniel. Why Follow poor John. Opposite? You really think that's possible? I saw some cable show about how your brain keeps going for a while after you, you know. You die? Forget about it. What they said didn't really stack up. I don't like the look of that place at all. Even if I speed run, I can't catch up to those two. All right. I'm not sure this is such a great idea. We should check it out. There could be a phone inside. I'll go in and take a look around. Go ahead. We'll be right behind you. Why aren't we going with those guys? I know something is up with you. You said I wasn't your boyfriend. Like, what a joke idea that is. <sighs> Are you for real? Our bus gets totaled, we get lost in fog, and your headline is some dumbass label? You're admitting boyfriend is not a label that you use for me. So what the fuck am I then? Lighten up. You know I was only messing with you. You didn't sound like you were messing just now. Come on, will you? That long, long face doesn't suit you. Your attitude towards us sucks. I don't know what to say to that. Maybe she is right about you. Let's just forget it. Or maybe you like older women more. You seem to fawn over everything she says. I'm really trying hard to like you, but you're not making it easy. <laughs> if you want me to take you seriously, then your shit needs to hold together a lot more than it has up till now. <sighs> you okay? I'm absolutely fine. Said every not okay person ever. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, I feel like I botched that one. Were you trying to get him back on your side, or? Well, like, I fucked up on the whole, like... It's your turn? You're playing Dingbat. So it's just randomly picking us. I think every so. time. Yeah. So it must flip a coin between who goes next and then rolls the dice as to who's next on the roster. Or it's preset in terms of like how the story plays out on who's next. Yeah, but maybe we're pre-assigned all the characters. Yeah. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me. But we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. 
What is? Yeah, if I walk into a bar and there's one dude in there sitting alone trying to drink, I probably would like leave him the fuck alone. I don't think it's stopping us from leaving. Yeah, yeah, I know that feeling. You mean you're trapped too? Sorry for busting in like this. Uh, bus we were on crashed a little way back up the road there. We're still a little shaken up. We're still a lot shaken up. He certainly looks shook up. I'm Vince. I need a mirror. Maybe there's one here not covered in 20 years of... Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. I need to keep a clear head. <clears throat> it's right there if you change your mind. Oh. Not for me. He must be a recovery. Why are you even here? Like a recovery. Little hope sure than the town it used to be. What happened here? The place seems completely deserted. Little Hope feels a little like a ghost town. And that fog? Life moves on, you know. But we don't all go with it. Maybe we should uh, leave him be. <laughs> There's all sorts in this place. What is this guy's problem? There's definitely something off about him. <laughs> Uh, he's harmless. Just had one too many. Let's look around. There must be something here that can help us. See what you can dig up. <clears throat> Am I intruding here? Not at all. I was about to take a look around anyway. Don't ask. But what are you do? Quick throw. Right. Figure out how we're getting out of here. Try for a big double. Or... Not my first time, Daniel. Shooting for double twenty. Okay, so you can play a little. Still got it. Now for triple twenty. Well, almost an Olympic shot after the night we've had. They don't play darts in the Olympics. You both suck as bad as each other. I'd keep that to yourself if you want to keep in with Taylor. We're not that crazy about each other right now. No way. Seems kind of choppy. You getting that? Not really. I mean, the aiming seemed a little funky, but... Well, not the aiming, just like the cuts from scene to scene. Like, it felt like I missed something or, like, didn't do exactly what the game wanted. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, I, I could see that. In terms of it going from scenario to scenario, just not very smooth. Yeah, it was just like, why am I playing darts? Scores. Yeah. Oh, wait. Aha! <laughs> this place has some great history. Oh boy. 1970 pamphlet. Are your children interested in ghost? Zoink Scoob. We're in the 1970s. I can't believe it. These guys could be relatives. That looks like us. <laughs> I'm just gonna put this down exactly where I found it. No, look at it again. Hey, Oops. This way. 
Let's get out of here. In the photograph, it looked like uh, like the guy characters were in there. I definitely heard something. Did you hear that as well? Come on. Whatever it was came from outside. Really think it's smart to go back outside? Well, there's nothing for us here. We need to move on. Best of luck. Hope you find what you're looking for. You're creepy. Yeah. I like you at the same time, but you're creepy. Right. Okay. Okay. Like, <laughs> does Tim get to play or? Nah. Uh, this is this is the Jason show now. I got tutorial rights, <laughs> and they're like, "Fuck that chaotic madness." <laughs> it's coming from the town. Did the old fucker just lock us out? He was weird, that old guy. Sure was something off about him. Why come to Creepy Central just to get a top up? What does that mean? Convenient that we all, oh, I think I'm using my phone. Yeah. I was like, did we seriously come out of the bus crash and find five flashlights? Hey, you. You look annoying. <laughs> Definitely is. I started. You know, the best part is if we were assigned characters, like, you get to play her. I have a bad feeling about this. And the cocksmith in the red shirt. Ugh. The way this fog just appears. The two people I didn't want to fucking play. I'm hoping it just randomizes who we play as, like the order in which the characters are set up are predetermined, but who is playing them is random, is what I'm hoping. Oh, but that's, that's encouraging. That's terrible, actually. Um, can I, can I interact? No. Just... What the hell is this thing? Looks like some kind of effigy. A warning, perhaps. Or some other spiritual significance. Whatever it is, it gives me the creeps. I don't know. I'm kind of curious about it. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's a border. Thing. Yeah, the person running in the background. I'm sorry. I didn't scare you, did I? I don't know which is scarier. Whatever this is, or your morbid interest in it. Oh my god, go fuck yourself. A lot of people still really believe in this kind of stuff. After tonight, I thought you might be joining them. Just because other people believe all sorts of garbage doesn't mean I'm about to. Guess you're right. Let's Whoops. catch up with the rest. I don't want to spend any more time with this disgusting thing. Ugh, I hate you so fucking much. Yep. You're intolerable and I accidentally agreed with you and I'm like feel dirty that I did. Yeah. Can you two make an effort to keep up? Oh, you're fucking hate you too. Ooh, a way to go by myself. No, it's a waste high fans. <laughs> You'll never make it. Plus dumb bitch juice is following you. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> just like, just to piss them off, walk in the opposite direction, be like, and come out in front of them. Yeah. Come on, I was, I do like the, the scorpion. Hey, you keep up. <laughs> yeah. Do like the scorpion teleport thing from Mortal Kombat. <laughs> yeah, where you fade off to screen right or something. Hey, can you come over here? No. What's wrong? I just saw someone in the woods. I can't see anyone. Probably because you have the eyesight of a dying bat. I definitely saw someone. 100%. Sorry, I don't buy it. Nobody just push her. Push her in the ravine. You two. We need to stick close. <laughs> Just 
All it would take is one, like, pat on the upper back, and down she goes. What on earth is that? Oh, sure, now you believe? We're freaked. Who's there? Whoever you are, this isn't funny at all. John, where are you? Daniel? Taylor? Sure, now you care. Mental asshole since you got here, but now you give a shit. Cause something's wrong. Self assured. Oh, can't walk that way. I was like, go right in the woods. <laughs> There's a demon in there. I know. Great. Oh, walk on this side of the road. Hey, wait for us. Oh no. Oh, I love how we're playing a horror game and Jason's in on it now. Only thing I can focus on is just being a complete fucking asshole hey. to have these people. Come and check this out. What on earth is that? Not a clue. Touch it. It's a voodoo doll. I was like, it's straight up a voodoo doll. Mm -hmm. Hello, puppet. Yeah, I was like, that's a puppet. Tim. <laughs> Tim. <laughs> this is a good place to cut. Pop <laughs> <laughs> it. Pop it. Pop it. <laughs> Twist it. Hit me, baby, one more time. <laughs> <laughs> ba, ba, ba. Oh, God. Oh! What is your name, sir? Jameric Way. I'm Andrew. Andrew? And your name, lady? Who the hell are you? Why are you dressed like that? I am called Mary. I fashioned her with my own hands. Wonderful. She looks just like the one beside you. Would you kindly come play with me? Come play. Come play with what me. Which is trickery is this now, Mary? I have done nothing. Hold your tongue. I see what you truly are, Mary. Reverend Carver's affection for you will be shaken loose when he learns of your infidelity with the devil. Mary, the girl burned in the house. Mm -hmm. That was Megan, though. Oh, that was Megan. Why? I I don't see any fire. I saw them too. Are you okay? No. This place is all wrong. Whatever happened here, it's over now. You have no clue. You didn't see what we saw. I don't get it. What exactly happened here? This young girl came out of the fog. Spoke to us. Maybe the fog has got you confused. We're all stressed out. Stressed my ass. I saw a girl dancing right here, clear as day. So lay her out with a bat. I like how she turned on him, like the professor, like that. Yeah. She talked in this really weird accent. Was that even American? I'm not sure. I couldn't place her accent either. American's not an accent. Into... Oh. This kid, Mary, did she want to hurt you? No. I don't think she meant to hurt me. Now what? Seems our only option is the road into town. You're kidding me. Still. Got a better idea? We're still fighting about this? Yeah, we go back to the bus. All right, go. Yeah, can't. Can't. Guess we're going forward. Let's go back to the booth. <laughs> Chapter one, complete. Are you having fun yet? 
escalated rather quickly. I'll say. Mm -hmm. Everything that one does or doesn't do in one's life will catch up with one eventually. Don't you think? I don't care. Don't look at me. I can't help you. Didn't ask. <laughs> Didn't ask. Don't care. <laughs> Sometimes congratulate ourselves on waking from a troubled dream. It may be so the moment after death. On my travels over many years, I've witnessed many things, seen and heard many beliefs, and there's usually some element of truth in each of them. These unfortunate folk seem to be dealing with forces as yet unexplained. I mean, sinister movements in the forest, the spirits from the past, a little girl who may be in trouble. Who might be trouble. Or maybe she simply is trouble. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> anyway, where are we? Angela isn't getting much tittle-tattle out of Taylor. <laughs> no kiss and tell. What about John? The figure of authority, perhaps. Or perhaps he represents something else. And then Diction, for sure. Somewhat confused, I think. A bump to the head can do that. Let me reassure you. You help make some decisions that will be valued later on. And some that may turn out to be regrettable. That fellow in the bar, he was less than helpful, more than a little rude, if you ask me. Clearly something disturbing on his mind. That wasn't that bad. I mean, it was that fine. was nice. We're the ones that barged in and started talking to him. Reminded me of, um, oh, uh... Oh, gosh. The guy who played War Machine in the event. Yes. What's yeah. his name? Don Cheadle. Yeah. Yeah. 